Hello. Today I would like to show you quite interesting antenna that is called a triple bazooka. Model that I've got is a purchased one and it's calibrated, sorry, it's tuned for the Citizen Band Radio. But this is the general schematic and you can make it for any frequency of your choice. And here is how it looks like. So we've got two arms and we've got a feeder going from the junction box. And this looks like a dipole, but actually it's not because this is not like a feeder. This is a part of the antenna. You can see that all these three parts are equal in length and they are connecting like the shell and the center wire. Here you can see how it's manufactured. But by the way, this is something that I just grabbed from Google to show you because this is a commercial one and I ordered that from a UK company. I believe they were only one who who made this type of antenna and looks like it's simple to make but because of the require for real estate yeah i i cannot make it in my room i have to make it and tune on the rooftop and this is a problem for me so i just wanted to to buy and pay someone to to make it tune exactly for the frequency and the company was a very good they asked me for a center frequency and i believe i ordered that for the sstv citizen band frequency because this is where i'm monitoring it and this is how it looks like i believe this is the part they are using for tuning so they just making a, a one length of this wire and if they ask you for a frequency they make it, it shorter or longer and then crimp it by the zip ties. So as you can see, it looks very nice. They've got uh, these insulators. And I was using this for my outdoor bag. As you can see, here was a very nice cap for the connector, but of course I, I lost it because I've got a paracord and it just you just break it off but yeah there was a tail cap so very nice here is our center junction and of course if it's not uh, if it's not crazy waterproof we are going to see what's inside because i was just i'm curious i'm not sure if that was a field with something to make it waterproof but let's just take a look. That looks like electrical junction box. So 100% you can do this yourself. You've got the schematic with the how to calculate the frequency. But if you are like me, I need to find something. And you cannot just go into the rooftop. Yeah, there is absolutely nothing, no balloon. Very easy to make, as you can see, just in case you would be interested. That is how it's made. So it looks like the center conductor is solid and here is disconnected from the from the shielding, the shielding was cut. That's how it looks like. And one part of the shield is going to the, to the hot wire, the center. And then other part of the shielding is going to the other shielding. And here on the bottom, they should be mixed just like here so the other shield is going to be hot wire and the hot wire become a 
shield just like that but this is i believe done something somewhere here so yes this is how it looks like so very simple antenna and i'm going to put it on my rooftop and hopefully it will work just fine and yes just just a quick look at the triple bazooka antenna thank you very much for watching see you next time and bye bye